Well, we're really excited today to have with us uh, Dr. Leah Jemison, longtime dean at Purdue University, uh, tenure, tenure there, and really influenced engineering education. I think it's fair to say that at this New Horizons in Engineering lecture today, that we'll hear from someone that has had a national, perhaps even international, imprint on engineering education. So I'm going to talk about, I think, the longest standing problem continues to be diversity. That we have made, as a field, some progress on representation of women in engineering, but there, we're still nowhere near, I think, where most of us would like to be. The national average for um, undergraduate women in engineering programs has been stuck at around 19 or 20 percent. For underrepresented minorities, a lot more geographic variation, but even lower. Increasingly, study after study is showing that the quality of innovation um, is a function of the diversity of the people sitting around the table, and, and diversity in a lot of dimensions, but it includes gender and race and ethnicity and national origin and economic background and life experiences, because you simply get a richer set of ideas. K through 12, that we still have great students, creative students, who don't have no clue what engineering is. And so it's hard to grow up thinking I'm gonna be an engineer if you don't know what it is, or if you have misconceptions. I would say that engineering is a team sport. I, how widely known is that? And so if you look at studies about what draws middle school girls to activities, to things, um, the, the social interaction's really important. And the fact that engineering isn't thought of as a team sport, well, I want to do something where I work with people a lot. I want to work on something where I have an impact on people. So engineering is a caring profession, also probably not one of the common perceptions. And so I think there's still things we've, we're learning but haven't fully been able to deploy to, to get the word out that this is something that resonates across groups much more broadly than traditionally been the, you know, you're, you're great at math and science, you should be an engineer. And there has to be more to it than that. If we can recruit students to universities to study engineering, we have to live up to that promise that you will be working with people, you'll be working and learning things that you can see how they're going to make a difference in people's lives. And so there's, there's a getting people in the door, but then there's also what are we doing to keep them? And there's even a third part that says when you are working, once you have your first job, what are you going to be doing? And does it have some glimmer of that promise about engineering changing the world in positive ways?